Man, it's been fun. I mean, I think that's what this team is like built off. Uh, like next man up, everybody being there for each other. We talk about it every day. It's just being a family, being complete as one, you know, and uh, just whenever your number get called, like we all believe in you to do your job at the best of your ability. So it's just, it's just been fun, man. Especially for, I mean, the guys in the secondary, you know what I mean? So. The standard is the standard. It don't matter who you are. Uh, it don't matter where you are on the depth chart. The standard is the standard. So when you get a rep and practice, whether it's scout team or with the, the defense, you got to take that rep. Like, it means something to everybody because we all depending on you to do your job, just like you depend on everybody else to do their job. So it don't matter where you are. The standard is the standard. And it doesn't get lowered based off who is out there. So. Coach, Coach talked about today about your special bond. Christian. You haven't been in Buffalo that long. Who, who is coach? McDermott. Okay, gotcha. Where did that come from? He says you guys are pretty close on and off the field. Where did that start? Um, probably like last year when I first got here, uh, he was kind of like just talking me through like how practice go and like how, how he viewed things, how he see things. And he was also asking me questions and stuff, you know, um, about how I see things. And we just, I started kicking it. And then, um, Start talking, then I met his uh his son. Uh, he met my son, and then from there it just was continuous, just talking every day, to praying together and stuff like that. So it just became like just friends, and then just from there it just kept going, and now it's like we're close friends. Relationship built off the field. Yeah, yep, yeah. and on the field, on the field. Success on the field. Yep. Yeah. When it comes to on the field, what makes him so special? He goes from a late round pick, quick starter in this league. What's allowed him? To well, I mean, I think he went to a basketball school, you know, Villanova. So I don't think people was looking there for football players. But uh, he popped up. But he, he just got that that attitude. Like, he got that nasty attitude about himself that, like, whenever he get around to play, he going he gonna to make sure you know he's around. Uh, he's disciplined. You know, one of the guys who I say who is real disciplined and, like, what he do. Um, he got good technique. And he, he just like he like playing football. He like competing. And I think that that's the – the attribute you gotta have when you out there is just want to compete and get better, and he has that. Does it surprise you how quickly this group of backups has stepped in and almost not missed a beat? Nah, not at all. Not at all. What, what is it about this group? What is it about these guys who are able to step in and, and you know do this role, do do what they've done? Yeah, I mean we all practice hard. Like we all practice hard. We all compete hard. Uh, we all got a standard. And everybody knows that. And we believe in We trust everybody that's in that, in that locker room, especially in that DB group. Like, we trust everybody. Like, anybody can go in there, and they're going to make plays. Like, that's just how we feel about ourselves. You know, that's the confidence we have with the group. What about Balin stepping in a short week, hardly no practice, and having to take over on the spot for Terrell? That's, that's how it be. Like, you never know what can happen out there on the ground. I mean, you don't want things to happen like that, but you just never know. You know what I mean? Like, you, but you got to practice. Even when you're not going to play, you got to practice like you're going to play. Like, I, I may not get no linebacker reps in the game, but all practice, I'm going to practice like I'm the starting linebacker, starting Will, Mike. And, and that's the approach that everybody takes when they out there. Like, for these plays I'm out there, I'm the starter. And then when Sunday comes and you're not playing, at least you're prepared. So. Playing under the lights on Monday night, how excited are you? And what are you looking forward to in front of Bill's Mafia? Uh, yeah, man, Shit. Just, just another win. It's another good game. Uh, defense just keep getting better. Uh, offense do their thing, and, you know. That's really it, just, just another win. There was also a conversation, I don't know if you saw it on social media, about um, New Jersey high school football. Uh, one of the coaches said that he thinks that New Jersey high school football could be a powerhouse. Having played New Jersey high school football, what do, what are, what's your opinion on that? I mean, I, I think we could. It's a lot of players from, from Jersey. On this team, on a lot of teams that I've been on, it's just a lot of guys. I just think our state is like kind of small, you know what I mean? So it ain't really compared to like the Miamis or the Georgia, Cali and stuff like that. But like, if we had the same population, we'd definitely be up there. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Bobby Babbage has described. <laughs> Sorry. No, no, that's fine. Bobby Babbage has described the defense as, as simple. Bond said it's simple, but it's complex. 
why does a simple defense work for you guys? I mean, you've played in a lot of defenses. It's not your first team. Why do you feel like simple works for this group? Um, so I would say defense is like, I'm trying to figure out how to say this, but in like a nice way, like, we don't really want to think for real. Like, we just want to hit everything moving, cover. So, like, when you put it simple, it's like we all could play faster because we ain't got to think too much or we ain't got to worry about too much going on. It's just like, this is what it is. Like, let's just go. So when you practice that every day, it gets easier and easier. Now you kind of know everything about how to do this exact one thing instead of practicing 16 things and, and being a, a major in one and then a minor in 15 others. But just you major in one thing and no minors. Now it's kind of like all your focus is just on your major. So that's what best fits for us as a defense.